Oh, bloody hell. I might be fat. I mean, I have been all my life, apart from a very short period in 2012 when I was eating clean. I had a personal trainer, so I exercised obsessively. Oh, and, and I, I, was, I was richer. Well, a bit, but enough to buy a cockload of salmon. But since then... Stop, I say, Mr. Fat Man, I say. Chubby Man, please stop running. Stop. My word, you're faster than you look. Where should I even begin? Firstly, you are far too heavy to have run this far. Your poor knees... And your plump little lungs must be full to bursting. See how sweaty and rosy-posy your little piggy face has grown. And think of your poor knees. Besides which, I'm not running anywhere. Just round and round in a big old fat old circle. Look, the floor's wearing down. Seriously, you're so heavy that you're wearing down the concrete floor. Gracious, how have you done that? Look, I'm not joking. See how it's worn? See? Look. Look. Now, look at the floor where your fatness has worn. Look, Mr. Fat Man. Look. You know, I, 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 I don't need to see it. I believe you. Someone else told me about ten minutes ago anyway. God, it's an awful lot of voices. And now, when anyone with a thumb and a connection is a published analyst, it's noisier than ever. I mean, a lot of it is cloaked in well-meaning intentions, but it's still loud. Some of it is angry. Hatred, even. Some voices sound as sweet as music on first listen, but when you isolate the bass notes and play them backwards, you can distinctly make out a subliminal under-whisper of Put down the eclair, booby boy. I don't think, I don't think it's all paranoia. And if it is, if it's just one of those bad days... I mean, imagine how dense that day feels when compacted with 34 years of information in every form and from every medium stating categorically how broken you are. How bodily girth is the fruit of idleness. Calories in versus calories out. Simple as breathing. Breathe in, breathe out, in, out, in, out. Shake it all about and that's your exercise sorted. Simple. Watch your water intake. At least two pints, litres, eight, maybe a glass or two, but... Don't hold the water weight. That's wheat, that is. Maybe you're intolerant. Cut it out. Do without it. You can. You can do it. You don't need it. Just think, ting. It's a second to reassess. Only a second, and then you won't want it. You can diet, can't you? It's not hard. It's simple. Calories in versus calories out. Low carb. Keto. No carb. Carbless. Less carbs, at least. Only 20 grams of carbs a day. Net carbs. That is discounting fibre. 30 grams. 50. Too much protein. Too much fat. Zero dairy. None at all. A coffee with cream to keep your hunger pangs at bay. Bread out, pasta out, have a zoodle. Will someone get this kid a spiralizer? It changed my life, saved my life. It might save yours. All that pressure on the NHS just because you can't pass up a Mars bar. Seriously, it's only sugar. It's poison. The white devil. Use honey instead or agave. It's nectar. Sounds healthier. This sweetness is from the cracked and ground body of a rare Vietnamese crab shell. Do you see how it almost tastes like sugar? But it's not. It's not sugar. It's really not. It's natural, organic. No pesticides here, not one. No, this one's got so many pests in it, you won't believe it. Pest-tastic, this is. Think of all those minerals. Good for you, they are. Slimming. They are. Slimming. You know, you could do with slimming down there a bit. And then I did. I lost it. Most of it, anyway. A combination of clean eating and an obscene amount of gym time. And hey presto, my shoulder no longer dislocates slightly when I'm pulling my pants up. My word, you look so good. So much healthier, so much better. Which is, which is good. Look at your face. God, you're so handsome. How did you do it? Tell me. What was the secret? Ah, uh, uh, um, I, I just, I just knew this time. Like I've, I've tried so many times before, but when I started this one, I just, I, I, I knew it would happen. And honestly, it felt amazing. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? I mean, where did you put it? Where have you gone? Um, I'm still here, <laughs> just. It's weird. It's diff. It's just different. I'm, I mean, don't get me wrong. You look amazing, but it's just it's it's weird. Uh, maybe it's just me. It probably is. I'll get over it. 
you're just you're you're just not the funny fat person you were before. Yikes! I thought I was. Clark is right at the top of the climbing rope, and I immediately am other. It's it's not that I don't want to do it. It's just it's not that it's hard. I just I just can't. I'm trying hard, but it doesn't make sense. These little arms of mine cannot lift this miniature hulk up a rope. Physiologically, it doesn't make sense. Anyway, Clark can do 20 forward rolls in a row, so maybe he's the odd one out. But the queue behind him is growing, and soon the rest of the class is following suit. I'm defying gravity. Jump in the pool, I'll show you who's athletic. I can swim circles round all of you. Buoyant, innit? Oh, and the legs. The legs that come from decades of load bearing. I am convinced one day my calves will be celebrated, sculpted in bronze and displayed at the Louvre. I do like my legs. It's a lot. But I do like my legs. <laughs>